Welcome to the History of Simple Things, where we delve into the fascinating history behind the little things that shape our world. Welcome to our channel. Today, we're going on a fascinating journey into the past to uncover the origins of one of the most ubiquitous tools in our toolbox, the flathead screwdriver. This tool, often overlooked in its simplicity, has a rich history intertwined with the evolution of technology, industry, and everyday life. So, grab your tool belt and let's dive into the story of the flathead screwdriver. The flathead screwdriver, characterized by its flat, wedge-shaped end, is a staple in the world of tools. To understand its origins, we need to step back in time to a period long before the invention of modern machinery, back to an era when craftsmanship was paramount, and the simplest of tools could make the difference between success and failure in construction and repair. Our story begins in ancient civilizations, where the basic concept of fastening objects together using a rotational force was already understood. The earliest evidence of tools resembling screwdrivers dates back to ancient Rome, around the first century AD. These rudimentary tools were used to turn screws made of wood, a material more readily available and easier to manipulate than metal. Roman craftsmen used these early screwdrivers to assemble and repair their wooden structures, demonstrating an advanced understanding of mechanical principles for their time. However, the screw and its corresponding driver remained relatively primitive until the Middle Ages. During this period, the technology of metalworking improved significantly, allowing for the production of more durable and precise screws and screwdrivers. Blacksmiths began to produce metal screws for armor and weapons, leading to the creation of more sophisticated tools to drive them. This period marked the first significant evolution of the screwdriver, moving from a simple tool to a more refined instrument of craftsmanship. The real breakthrough for the flathead screwdriver came during the Renaissance, a time of great technological and scientific advancement. Leonardo da Vinci, the quintessential Renaissance man, made detailed sketches of various machines and tools, including a screw cutting machine. His designs contributed to the standardization and improved production of screws and screwdrivers. The Renaissance period laid the groundwork for the mass production techniques that would later revolutionize tool manufacturing. Fast forward to the 18th century, a time when the Industrial Revolution was beginning to take shape. This era saw significant advancements in machinery and manufacturing processes, driven by the need for efficiency and precision in the burgeoning factories. The screw, as a fastener, became increasingly important due to its reliability and ease of use. As the demand for screws grew, so did the need for a reliable tool to drive them, the flathead screwdriver. In 1744, English instrument maker and engineer Jesse Ramsden invented a screw cutting lathe, which allowed for the mass production of screws with consistent threads. This invention was pivotal as it enabled the widespread use of screws in various applications from machinery to furniture. Consequently, the flathead screwdriver became an essential tool in both industrial and domestic settings. The precision and uniformity of Ramsden's screws necessitated a tool that could fit perfectly into the screw's slot, driving it with efficiency and minimal damage. Thus, the flathead screwdriver as we know it began to take shape. The 19th century brought further advancements with the rise of industrialization. Factories churned out vast quantities of goods and the need for standardized tools became more apparent. During this period, the flathead screwdriver underwent refinements to improve its functionality and ease of use. Toolmakers experimented with different handle designs, materials, and manufacturing techniques to produce screwdrivers that were not only effective, but also comfortable to use. Wooden handles were common, but the introduction of metal handles and later plastic ones improved durability and user experience. One notable figure in the history of the flathead screwdriver is Henry F. Phillips. 
In the early 20th century, Phillips recognized the limitations of the flathead design, particularly in industrial applications where speed and efficiency were critical. He invented the Phillips head screw and driver, which allowed for more torque and reduced the risk of the driver slipping out of the screw head. Despite this innovation, the flathead screwdriver remained an important tool, especially in applications where the Phillips head's self-centering design was not necessary or where flathead screws were already in use. The flathead screwdriver's simplicity and versatility ensured its continued use and adaptation even as other types of screwdrivers were developed. Throughout the 20th century, it remained a common household tool, essential for a wide range of tasks from assembling furniture to repairing appliances. Its straightforward design made it accessible to everyone, from professional craftsmen to DIY enthusiasts. The flathead screwdriver's story is one of adaptation and resilience. From its humble beginnings in ancient Rome to its essential role in modern electronics, this tool has evolved alongside human ingenuity and technological progress. Its design may be simple, but its impact on construction, manufacturing, and daily life is profound. To conclude, the origins of the flathead screwdriver are deeply rooted in human history, reflecting the evolution of craftsmanship and technology. This tool has adapted to meet the needs of each age, proving its enduring utility and importance. Whether you're a professional tradesperson or a DIY enthusiast, the flathead screwdriver is a testament to the power of simplicity and the ingenuity of human invention. Thank you for joining us on this historical journey. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. As we've talked about the flathead screwdriver, let's now dive into the Phillips head screwdriver. You may not give much thought to this simple tool, but its invention revolutionized the way we build and repair things. Let's take a journey back in time to discover the fascinating origins of the Phillips head screwdriver. In the early 20th century, the industrial world was rapidly evolving. Factories were bustling with activity, and the assembly line was becoming the standard for mass production. However, there was a significant problem that needed solving. The flathead screw and screwdriver, which were the most commonly used at the time, had major limitations. They were prone to slipping, which often resulted in damaged screws, tools, and even injuries. This inefficiency was costing manufacturers time and money, creating a demand for a better solution. Enter John P. Thompson, a little-known inventor with a big idea. In the late 1920s, Thompson designed a screw with a cross-shaped slot and a matching driver. This design allowed for greater torque and reduced the likelihood of the driver slipping out of the screw head. Despite the innovative nature of his design, Thompson struggled to market his invention. It wasn't until he met Henry F. Phillips, a businessman with a keen eye for potential, that things began to change. Phillips saw the promise in Thompson's design and acquired the rights to the invention in 1935. Henry F. Phillips wasn't an inventor, but he was a savvy entrepreneur. He understood that for the crosshead screw to be successful, it needed to be adopted by the automotive industry, which was booming at the time. Phillips approached the American Screw Company and convinced them to produce the new screw and driver. His persistence paid off when General Motors decided to use Phillips screws in the production of their 1936 Cadillac. The results were impressive. The new screws reduced assembly time and increased efficiency on the production line. The introduction of the Phillips head screw into the automotive industry was a game changer. The crosshead design allowed for self-centering of the screw, which meant that it could be driven in more efficiently by assembly line workers. This was particularly important in the fast-paced environment of automobile production, where time and precision were of the essence. The reduced likelihood of cam out, where the driver slips out of the screw head, meant fewer damaged screws and less wear on tools, leading to cost savings for manufacturers. The success with General Motors set off a domino effect, and soon other manufacturers were adopting the Phillips head screw. The design's self-centering property, 
and the ability to apply greater torque without damaging the screw made it ideal for use in various industries, from automotive to aerospace. By the 1940s, the Phillips head screwdriver had become the standard in many sectors, cementing its place in industrial history. During World War II, the Phillips head screwdriver saw even more widespread use. The need for rapid and reliable assembly in military manufacturing plants, producing everything from Jeeps to aircraft, underscored the advantages of the Phillips head design. The screw's reliability under high stress conditions made them invaluable in the production of military equipment, further entrenching their status as an industrial staple. Today, the Phillips head screwdriver is ubiquitous. It's a staple in every toolbox, from professional mechanics to DIY enthusiasts. While there are now many other types of screw heads and drivers, the Phillips head remains one of the most popular and widely used. Its enduring legacy is a testament to the ingenuity and vision of those who saw the need for a better solution and brought it to life. So, the next time you pick up a Phillips head screwdriver, remember the remarkable journey it took to become an essential tool in our everyday lives. It's a story of innovation, perseverance, and the relentless pursuit of improvement. Thanks for joining us on this historical journey. See you next time. Welcome to History of Simple Things, where we unravel the intriguing narratives behind everyday objects. Today, join us as we embark on a deep dive into the intricate history of screws, an invention that has threaded its way through time to become an essential component in our modern world. Our journey begins in ancient times, where rudimentary forms of screws were used in devices like the Archimedes screw, a helical pump believed to have been invented by the Greek mathematician Archimedes in the 3rd century BCE. These early screws were primarily used for tasks like lifting water and grain, showcasing the ingenious principles of rotational motion and mechanical advantage. These primitive screws laid the foundation for the development of more sophisticated designs in the centuries to come. In the Middle Ages, craftsmen refined the art of screw-making, producing intricate wooden screws for use in presses and other mechanical devices. Notably, Johannes Gutenberg's invention of the wooden screw press revolutionized the printing industry, enabling the mass production of books and spreading knowledge far and wide. With the onset of the Industrial Revolution in the 18th century, screws underwent a remarkable transformation. Advances in metallurgy and machining techniques allowed for the mass production of standardized screws, fueling the expansion of industries like textiles, transportation, and construction. The invention of the screw-cutting lathe further revolutionized screw production enabling manufacturers to create threads with unprecedented precision and efficiency. In the 20th century, the advent of industrial automation and computer-aided design propelled screw manufacturing into the modern age. Today, screws are produced using a variety of cutting-edge techniques and materials. Cold forming, or cold heading, involves shaping metal wire into screw blanks using high-pressure dies, resulting in screws with exceptional strength and durability. Machining, utilizing computer-controlled lathes and mills, allows for the precise cutting of threads into metal rods, yielding custom screws tailored to specific applications. Injection molding, a process commonly employed for plastic screws, entails injecting molten plastic into a mold cavity, where it solidifies to form the desired screw shape. Screws can be crafted from a diverse array of materials, including steel, aluminum, 
brass, and even exotic alloys like titanium. Each material offers unique properties such as strength, corrosion resistance, and conductivity, making it suitable for a wide range of applications. From securing electronics to assembling automobiles, screws play a pivotal role in countless aspects of modern life. Whether it's the microscopic screws in our smartphones or the colossal bolts anchoring our bridges, these unassuming fasteners are the unsung heroes of engineering. Our journey through the annals of screw manufacturing has unveiled a rich tapestry of ingenuity, resilience, and progress, from the ancient origins of rudimentary screw-like devices to the sophisticated automated processes of the modern era. The evolution of screws stands as a testament to human innovation and perseverance. Throughout history, screws have played a pivotal role in shaping civilizations, enabling the construction of monumental structures, the advancement of technology, and the dissemination of knowledge. From the groundbreaking invention of the wooden screw press by Johannes Gutenberg to the precision machining techniques of the Industrial Revolution, each era has contributed to the refinement and expansion of screw manufacturing. Today, the production of screws has reached unprecedented levels of sophistication with state-of-the-art machinery, advanced materials, and computer-aided design revolutionizing the industry. Cold, forming, machining, and injection molding techniques have elevated screw manufacturing to new heights, allowing for the production of screws with unparalleled precision, strength, and versatility. But beyond the realm of engineering and industry, screws embody a deeper significance, a symbol of human ingenuity and the relentless pursuit of progress. They serve as a reminder of our capacity to overcome challenges, adapt to change, and push the boundaries of what is possible. As we reflect on the history of screw manufacturing, let us not only marvel at the technological advancements and innovations that have shaped our world, but also recognize the dedication, skill, and craftsmanship of the countless individuals who have contributed to this remarkable legacy. In the midst of a rapidly evolving technological landscape, the humble screw remains a timeless testament to the power of human creativity and collaboration. So, let us continue to turn the screws of curiosity, exploration, and discovery as we embark on new adventures and uncover the mysteries of the world around us. Join us in celebrating the extraordinary journey of screw manufacturing and stay tuned for more captivating explorations into the fascinating realm of invention and discovery. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.